So we have two awesome community guests tonight, which I'm very excited about. The first one we're going to speak to needs no introduction. She's Kim Schaefer from the Downtown Project. And you've got some exciting news to share with us. You've created an app for the Downtown Project, right? We really have uh, this really cool new app that one of the greatest problems, and I'm sure everybody in this room and people who are watching will agree, one of the biggest challenges of a, an accelerating community is how you keep track of what's going on. Very true. And so it's been something we've struggled with from the very, very beginning. And uh, this app is sort of a solution, we hope, to at least part of that problem. So it's a centralized place where people can go right on their smartphone. They can know what's happening downtown in the next few days. Uh, event organizers can go right on there and add their, app, their events themselves. We do a little moderation just to make sure that our, <laughs> our audience doesn't get any spam. And then it, it becomes this really simple tool to know what's happening in, in the neighborhood. This is awesome and it, it has kind of been almost like an evolution of downtown, the, you know, the community, because when we first started, there was one thing on per night. And now there's about six things on each night and you sort of like, you get so upset when you miss out on something. You'll see photos on Facebook, you'll be like, why didn't I know about that? So I'm guessing that this app really solves that problem. I think it will help. I don't think it will keep you from missing things because you just can't, unless you're lucky, you don't have clones. You can't be in two places at once. Very true. But it is really, a, I think, a, a milestone for us as a neighborhood as Absolutely. a community because we've gone from this time when I knew everything that was going on and I could be everywhere <laughs> all the time and now suddenly there are a million things happening and so many people who are really, really engaged and really passionate and creating these incredible reasons for people to gather and to collide and learn with one another and so we are hopeful that this will be a vehicle for people to find those opportunities. That's awesome and I imagine it will be really useful for people who are coming out of town and they're doing trying to mingle with the community and all they need to do is get an app and they can just start going to things, right? Absolutely. It's, it's it's our plan to use that it just it, when we have so many guests that come and visit uh, Downtown Project to just include a link to the app in their itinerary when we send it to them uh, in their email and that way they know when they get here and they can they don't have to depend on people who are inviting them out they can learn about what's happening sort of in an organic and really natural way and experience the neighborhood on their own. That's perfect. Now I'm sure a lot of work went into it so we want as many people to download it as possible so it's on the iTunes store right for it's iOS on the iTunes right now? Down now. Mm -hmm. store now. We, it's just for Apple right now. We worked with a great Vegas tech company, Raster Media. You can see Let's George at the front. <laughs> The app is on the iTunes store now, and we're talking about the next iteration, which would be Android or something that would work for all smartphones. But you got to start somewhere. Right? Absolutely, and the iPhone is a great platform to start with. Well, thank you so much, it's and my like, pleasure. Thanks I hope that everybody in the audience takes the chance. Actually, I can see a lot of people right now; <laughs> they're going to be downloading it very soon. So, um, excellent work in another chapter in the downtown tech and the downtown project scene. Thank you so much. Thank you. Now, before we end uh, your particular chat, I'm going to get you to have the honor of picking the fortune cookie of the week. I'm going to dig down. Deep. you got to dig right down? Yeah, right. That's what I like. I like to get down to the heart and soul of what's going on. This is going to be a good one, I can tell. Can we get our fortune cookie handler, Alan, out, please? Oh my gosh, you have to <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Things have changed since last time you came very on. Very special. Thank you very much, Alan. It's my pleasure. And thank, thank you, Kim. You.